Happy Saturday. So I decided I was going to join in on the C collab with Catherine and Casey. So I do have my basket pulled. This week is vendor week. I don't have the like their information printed. I'm a slacker. I'm sorry. I didn't join in last week because it was Mardi Gras and I really didn't know what to pull. So I was like, I'm not going to do that. So this week, my vendor is going to be the Melted Moose. Uh, a couple reasons. I have some more wax coming in from her pre-order pre that she had. And uh, then I put my name on her customs, which I'm like number 13 or 14. So it's not like that will be anytime soon. Uh, but I thought I would use up some of the wax that I had. So let's go through what I pulled. Now, I didn't pull all my wax. I have more than this. But I wanted to get through some of the wax I've had for a while. So... Let's start with that. Okay, beach towels, which is fluffy towels and salty sea air. This is a very nice blend. I'm definitely planning on warming this in the laundry room though because it's just generally not my jam. So I'm gonna actually move this over. Okay, next up is cloud cookies. This is sugar cookies, vanilla butter, fudge, vanilla bean, and marshmallow whip. I really, really love this. I had this in a scent shot. I warmed this. I got it in a souffle, and I would actually reorder this in a loaf. This was a custom. Good morning. Um, so this is cereal killer and lemon curd. Very, very good. So cereal killer and lemon curd. This one is Midnight Lemonade Stand. It's pink lemonade, blackberry, and pink champagne. Again, a great fizzy blend. Oh, this is so good. Oh, this just smells like the perfect um, champagne, but you definitely get blackberry and pink lemonade in this. This is so good. I love lemonade blends. Okay, what other souffles? This one is from, and she does have pour dates. This was poured last February. This is from her Easter pre um, order she had. It's called What's Up Doc. It's carrot cake, cream cheese frosting, and what the carb. Her what the carb is so good. Look at how cute this is, but I have to warm this. This is a year old. Oh, it's so good. And I want to see what I think of her carrot cake blend, and this is the only one I have, so I thought I better get this warmed and try it. This is another one I recommend, Black Magic Woman. Vivian recommended this to me. It's very unique, but it I'm looking forward to warming it. French lavender, Egyptian amber, tonka, myrrh, and sweet magic fizz. It is so unique. Oh, I just love this. Lavender and fizzy. Oh, and you do get a little bit of those, like the amber, tonka, and myrrh. I, I want to warm this because I want to see if I want more of that. I have Italian lemon cookies. This is from... March of last year. So this is a really good cookie, but it's not my favorite, so I wanna warm it and see how it performs. This is Return to Me, this is a custom I did. This is Fruit Loops, Vanilla Ice Cream, and Cotton Candy Frosting. Very good lemon, or Fruit Loops, oh my gosh, I can't talk, sorry. This is a great Fruit Loops. Again, um, this is a custom I did. Have you seen that movie Return to Me with, um, Oh my gosh, I'm gonna draw a blank. Mini Driver and the guy from the X-Files was in it. So I was watching that recently and it just kind of reminded me of my husband and I that we were middle school like friends, kind of obsessed with each other. And then I moved away and um, fresh after our freshman year and then um, reconnect when we were like 17, 18, and then kind of didn't talk for a while. And then when I was 20, in my 20s. So I just really like that. The movie is completely different. So it's not, you'd have to watch the movie. Let me know if you've seen it. It's an older movie. I just recently rewatched it. This one is Kiss Me at Midnight. She, I don't remember when she had this, but this is Cashmere Plum and Vanilla Champagne. And I was like, I want to try this. This is beautiful again I love her fizzy champagne blends so I want to warm it so I can kind of let you know how it does okay so I have one more souffle in here and then the rest are some leftover souffles or cut up souffles this is shitters full this is a custom I did in December um, it is 
key lime pie, cream cheese frosting, and frosted graham crackers. I have to say that I really enjoy this on cold. Really do. I love the color. I, if this warms well, I have key lime pie. I don't know if I'm gonna warm the key lime pie. I only have a little bit left. Um, I, so we'll see if I warm this and then maybe the next day I'll just warm the regular key lime and just kind of see, but I, this to me smells great on cold. And she's got an exceptional key lime. Okay, these are one that I cut up. This is strawberry pound cake and what the carb. Love her what the carb. I have my newest order is coming from her and it's strawberry pe pretzel salad. I just can't wait to get that. I I love that scent. I love her what the carb, but not the biggest, depending, depending on the blood, like the strawberry pound cake, it can be hit or miss for me. Um, pump, this one is pumpkin pretzel, what the carb. So it's pumpkin pecan waffles, soft pretzels, and what the carb. This is really, really, really good. Love this. I want to finish that, see how, it, like remind myself, do I love it? Do I need, like what size do I need again? This is honey butter rolls. This is fresh baked yeast rolls with a hint of whipped cinnamon butter. Phenomenal. Oh, so, so good. It is a little doughy in this, but I will say this is beautiful warmed. I, if you like these kind of scents, I would definitely get that. All right, let's see what other leftover souffles I have. And we'll get into some shapes, some scent shots, and a few other items. This one is uh, a custom that I cut up. This was a souffle, it's, that's what she said. If you don't know what that's from, I'll share it now, but you should know this. This is cotton candy, pink lemonade, and fizzy pop. <laughs> This is really, really good. Oh, she just has some really good lemonade, fizzy champagne blends. I really wish she'd get Coastal Kale. I've asked her multiple times if she would please order that oil or she could find it. I wish she would, because I would love to get it from her. This is cracked. I got it cracked. This is pie crust. I need to warm. This is from December of 2020. These were a little, um, she did this from the Easter thing last year, All My Peeps. It's a Peeps blend. Very good. I want to warm this and see what I think of this because this is really good on cold. All right, this is Fizzy Pop. Am I going to get through all these? I don't know, but you know I can use one of these in one of my spaces and they're gone. Apple S'mores, Macintosh, Apple, Marshmallow, Fireside, and Toasty Grams. I think I have this in a souffle, so I want to use it. Maybe if I do, maybe I'll pull some of these for random act of kindnesses. I'm going to, I'm going to leave this one out because I have this. It's, it's the great pumpkin. So I'm going to save that for a random act of kindness because I like to share the melted mousse. Kettle corn, really very much kettle corn. It is kettle corn. Bum, bum, boom, boom, whatever it is. Is it bum like your butt or boom like an explosion? I swear it's bum bum like your butt but i don't know this one is amish harvest dried fruits pumpkin cinnamon cloves it's cracked so i need to use it that one's interesting i don't know if i love that i really loved when she did these sun shots only because when you're trying out a new vendor and then you get these you can really decide if you like something so this is nog nap it's spiced eggnog marshmallow and what the carb i really do like this i want to warm this again because I would really like this for next year. Oh, this is a very unique eggnog blend. So I really want to try that again. This is Moose Lodge. A cozy blend of apple, caramel, maple, warm vanilla. I really like this. A great caramel apple blend. I don't get a lot of maple on cold. So more of the caramel and the apple. We'll see when I warm that. I was really going to pick Scentsy. But then I'm like, it's not really a vendor. It's retail. And then... I, I really want to just use her wax up because I have, like I said, some of these scent shots that are really are, are older. This one is pumpkin. It's pumpkin, coconut, cupcakes, and toasted marshmallow. This is good. Not a favorite on cold, but I've been surprised by her wax. So you just never know when you warm it. This one is root beer float. I love, love, love this. Oh, it's so... If you want the most authentic root beer that I've ever smelled, which I haven't smelled a lot of them, this is it. It literally reminds me of summers and having root beer floats on the porch with my kids. This is phenomenal. It's like making my mouth water because it reminds me, I, like I literally want to drink the wax. It's so good. 
Um, I have a little bit of root beer smoked, and this is frothy root beer and smoked vanilla. This is very, very unique. It's almost like you have root, root beer in a like barrel or something, like a smoky barrel that's been sitting in. Does that make sense? This is very interesting. She has a smoked blackberry too. I wish, like I said, I wish she would do like a big scent shot sale um, or RTS because I would love to try again some of these blends and just and just because it's nice to have a little bit of them. This one is dreaming of football season. It's zucchini bread, earthen oak, and a hint of apple cider. I don't know if this is a favorite. It's good, but I want to warm it. Like I said, that's kind of the whole point of this. I'm sorry if I keep saying that. I don't mean to be annoying. It's just, I'm sorry. This one is cranberry woods. I, I keep putting this in my basket and then I never warm it. I don't think I really like this. I don't know why. So I really want to warm this and because I think this is kind of like a type, like cranberry woods type from, is it Yankee or something? I don't know why I just keep pulling that and never warming it. This one is Carnival Confection. I think this is her own blend. It's funnel cakes, cotton candy, and fried ice cream. I did warm some of it. I don't know. It's good. It's just I have my favorite. And that's not it. <laughs> okay, this one is Fry Me to the Moon. It's Bear Claws, Funnel Cakes, and Deep Fried Ice Cream. This was from her... Was it the Valentine or no? I think she had bakery or some lavender boxes. I think it was Valentine's Day. I want to warm this. It's very much bear claws. I do get a hint of funnel cake. It's just different. So I want to warm that and see what I actually think of it. This one is love you very much. It's wild berry cheesecake, raspberry zingers, and cupcakes at Tiffany's. Oh, so good. If this warms well, I would get that in like at least a souffle in customs. This one I wasn't going to warm, but then I just keep going back and forth because it seems I just really like it on cold. And Lori Brown, if you're watching, I think you would like this one. This is I'm a Sucker for You. Great blow pops, raspberry, cranberry, champagne, and cotton candy frosting. This is an exceptional grape. And I am I love grape granita from Sensi, but that's like the only grape and it's like the only one I love. This one is really, really, really good. So it intrigues me, so I am going to warm it. This is Kiss Me Like You Miss Me. It's strawberry pound cake and crushed almond cookies. I, I love this. You know that I love um, Sensi's cherry almond pie. This is really good. Oh, I wanna warm this. If this performs well and it, it you know does well in my open area, I would get that. Okay, I have a few samples in here. Wake Up Buttercup, House on the Haunted Hill. Um, bumpkin and then this one is pink sugar vanilla bean and peppermint this was someone's customs and i have a lot of these blends but if i didn't i would absolutely order this, this is so strong on that peppermint but you get the pink sugar and the vanilla uh this is a custom a long time ago i love this i haven't cut this up her popsicle this is boardwalk bum is it boom boardwalk bum bum whatever it's boardwalk marshmallow clouds and bum bum boom boom cream I, this is a favorite all time scent of mine. I, this makes me so happy. Just literally makes me happy. Okay, another favorite of mine from her is maple rolls. It's honey butter rolls, glazed maple. Look at how dirty that is, sorry. Oh, I told you I love maple and this is phenomenal. It's like the best maple. Um, and you definitely get these butter rolls. It's like you took the butter rolls and you poured some maple syrup on it. So good. Oh, I forgot about this one. Case of the Mondays. Fabulous. Salted caramel. Uh, zucchini bread and a hot cup of coffee. I actually have this in a souffle. So if I need more of this, I'll cut the other souffle up. This one is Morning Pumpkin. Vivian is great. She recommends some scents to me. And this is another one she did. This is Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, Zucchini Bread, and Coffee. I wrote strong, lasted three days on this label. Oh, gosh, is that good. Oh, this mm, just makes my mouth absolutely water. This is, if you love Pumpkin Pecan Waffles and Coffee, Lori Brown, Okay, Loopy Laundry. This is an original love of mine. It's clean cotton and Fruit Loops. And I don't like a laundry laundry, but this is one, this is like my favorite laundry. So good, so worth it. Another one because I love Palo Santo is the Great Pumpkin. It's it's pumpkin donuts, salted caramel, and Palo Santo. Oh, this is just 
you really smell this and you're kind of like, okay, this is, I can smell the donuts and the pumpkin and a little bit of caramel and that the Palo Santo is strong. But when you warm this, it's just magical. I gotta tell you, these last ones that I have, these up, there's a reason I have them in loaves and larger amounts. I didn't pull a few others. Oh, oh Cindy Lou, who I love. I did warm that the other night to bed, so I might pull that and use that again. So you'll see what, so this will go up on Saturday, the 5th, and then the following Sunday, I will do the warm, like review how it performs and everything like that and show you what I actually got through. So this is the collab with Casey and Catherine. They are welcoming everybody, inviting you all. If you wanna do it and you want the list, you can um, contact one of them on Instagram or um, I think on Facebook they said, and you can, so they can email you the list of what they're gonna go through each week. I think that's so great. I love the prompts. Like I said, I didn't do last week because Mardi Gras, I was like, I don't wanna really pull a lot of glitter. I don't like those in my warmers. I know it's easy to clean, I don't care. I just hate like big glitter in my wax. I just, I'm not a fan of it. So it's just my personal preference um, about wax. So I, just want to say i hope you guys are joining in i hope you're liking this again let's lift up the wax community as a whole and spread positivity not negativity because there are some people who really just like to be that way and i don't enjoy that so i just want to say i hope you have a wonderful beautiful blessed day bye